Hello everyone, welcome back. In today's topic, we'll cover about polynomial functions. We have seen different types of functions, even n word function, absolute function, and now we will see about polynomial functions. But don't forget to subscribe, share, and like the video and our channels. So polynomial function is a real polynomial, p of x, which means of degree of n is an expression of the form p of x, which means a polynomial function of p, the subset of x, p n x the power of n plus p n minus 1 x the power of n minus 1 plus p n minus 2 x n the power x the power of n minus 2 plus p2 x the power of 2 plus p1 x the power of 1 plus x naught x the power of 0. This form is called a polynomial function form yes all the polynomial functions are written like this yes so where pn plus 0 p0 p1 pn are all real numbers n is an integer which means it will be yes greater than or equal to 0 it is an integer but it's greater than or equal to zero, which means the domain is restricted. Yes, the domain is restricted, which means this value is valid for only the value which is equal to zero and greater than. That's an integer, but as we know, integer means it includes zero, negative, and positive. But for the polynomial function, we only use integers, which is zero and the positive number all polynomials are defined for all real x and are continuous function so all polynomial functions are a continuous function we have to concern more this so let's see about uh, this uh, the forms uh, and each values or each compo uh, symbols uh, that determine so p u n p n minus one p n minus two p one p naught are called the coefficient of the polynomial function. The number p n is called the leading coefficient of the polynomial function, and p n x n is the leading term, which means p n x the power of n x the power of n means this is the leading term all. All this value is the leading term, yes, but p the power of p, p n means the leading coefficient, the leading, the leading term of the leading coefficient. Those other values are the minor values because n will be decreased by the consecutives n minus 1, n minus 2, up to n equals to 0. n will not be negative, yes. It, because the value is only given for the integer n is an integer which is greater than or equal to zero so the first uh, value all this it, the pn is the leading coefficient and xn is the leading term and the number zero yes the number zero is called the constant term of the polynomial yes it is the constant term which is which means a number or uh, it doesn't contain x, uh, any variable. And the number n, the exponent of the s power of x, is the degree of the polynomial. Yes, n means the degree of what? The polynomial. So this is uh, all about. This is all so uh, that the domain of a polynomial function is or a real number. Yes, a real number, a real polynomial p of x of degree n is, is an expression of the form. Yes, this form, for example, f of x equals 2 over 3x to the power of 4 minus. 12x squared plus 7 over 8, which is 
a polynomial function because it, it, it is written in the form of the polynomial function as we see from this value 2 over 3 is the leading coefficient x to the power of 4 minus 12x squared plus 7 over 8 so it is a polynomial function of degree 4 n equals to yes what n equals to 4 we seen the which means we uh, focus when we talk about degree we only focus about the coefficient the, the 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 power of n that is the highest one in the polynomial function or in the given expression the highest value of n is our degree and the leading coefficient means the highest value of degree, the coefficient of the highest degree, and the constant term is equal to 7 over 8. So 2 over 3 is the leading coefficient. Uh, 2 over 3 x to the power of 4 at the leading term. Yes, f of x, x over x, which is not a polynomial function because its domain is not real number. The domain of the fun the domain of uh, the polynomial function must be real number, but for this expression, the domain is not real number. So uh, by this by this means, uh, it's not a polynomial function. And f of x equals 3x squared plus 3x plus 1. This is a polynomial function of degree 2 and a leading coefficient 3 and a constant term 1. This is a constant term, which means it's only a number without containing the variable x. It is the same value as the same expression as the, uh, the, this value, but the difference one is the coefficient or the degree is negative. But in this time, this is not a polynomial function because the degree must be an integer which is greater than or equal to zero. So the degree will not be a negative value. By this case, it is not a polynomial function because one of its terms has a negative exponent, yes? So the, the form and the degree of the a polynomial is the highest uh, power of x in its expression, yes? We, uh, when you find the degree of a polynomial function, we select from the expression that is the highest one. A constant or non-zero polynomials are polynomials of degree zero, which means x to the power of zero equals one. Let's uh, let's say two the power of uh, two x the power of zero means two, because the power of zero is one. Every number the power of zero or every number degree, every every number the, every function or every number that has degree of zero is equals to one. So the constant polynomial are polynomial of degree zero. Linear polynomial means it's degree one, which means x plus one, x plus two, like that. The quadratic polynomials of degree two, mean quadratic means x squared plus three x plus two, like this. And uh, a polynomial of degree three is called cubic. Yes, x to the power of three plus x squared plus x, which means x cubed. So it is, and for the degree of 4, the polynomial which uh, have degree 4, it's called uh, quartix. So the function f of x equals to 0 is also a polynomial, but we say that it is degrees undefined. Yes, it's, it's degrees no, undefined, but it is a constant term, so it is uh, also a polynomial function. Uh, for example, 4x cubed minus 3x squared plus 2 is a polynomial of degree 3. Because uh, the, there are two degrees, uh, three and two, so the high, the, the degree of the polynomial is the highest value of the x, uh, which is three. This is called a cubic polynomial, yes, or just a cubic, because the degree is three. It is uh, x the power of seven minus four x five plus one is a polynomial of degree seven. Mm, seven is the highest power of x. Yes. Four x square as we see x square mean the power of the degree two. Uh, the function uh, which have degree two is called a quadratic function. Uh, we are more familiar with these types of functions. 
Sometimes functions containing other operations such as square roots, divisions are not polynomials because their uh, domain is not a real number. Let's say for f of x equals 4x to the power of cubed plus radical x minus 1 is not a polynomial function because this function contains a square root and this value is not uh, which haven't the domain which is not a real number. And the second one is f of x equals 4x the power of 5 minus x squared plus 3 over x. This 3 over x is divided by x, you know, which means is not a polynomial function as it contains a divided by x. Yes. So uh, this is all about the polynomial functions. Uh, I taught. You have get some information about polynomial functions with clear uh, explanation. So thank you everyone. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. If you have any question and suggestion, you can write down in uh, comment section and we'll respond uh, immediately. So thank you everyone.